Hey, what's happening there, guys? Elton here, aka Retro Old School. A beautiful Monday afternoon, quickly turning into evening, unfortunately, because it is four o'clock. And, uh, you know, we have that stupid fucking daylight savings, which is absolutely ridiculous. And, I mean, you know, it gets dark now just before five o'clock, which is ridiculous. So now I'm on the corner of Curie La Belle and, uh, let's see, what's the cross street here? I think it's uh, Concorde. No, it's Notre Dame. Notre Dame, right. All right, uh, it is a beautiful day. Today, yesterday was beautiful too, but it was bloody cold because of the wind. Oh my God, it's cold. Now, this is not gonna be a really, really long walk though because I've been walking quite a while now. I'm kind of pooped, kind of pooped, you know? 2009. Yeah. I've been meandering around, meandering around here looking for old cars. I did find a early 90s Nissan 300ZX. Beautiful car. Classic in its own right. You know what I mean? And that's a City of Laval truck right there, eh? Yeah. City Ville de Laval. Right on. So. I was thinking about doing a walk here on one of the side streets here, down there. And I'm like, ah, you know, then if I do that, what if something's responding and I miss it? Especially a fire truck, so, oh, yo, yo, that's, uh, that would suck, you know. I like to have some kind of a variety in all the videos I film, so. Not exactly the most interesting street, but a lot of action, a lot of vehicle action, you know. Yeah, thanks a lot there, you fucking guy. That jerk fuck, supposed to let me cross, you know. Actually, come to think of it, I had I think he had the fucking arrow to cross and it, for me to cross. Anyway, whatever. Doesn't matter. I was tempted to go in that village de valeur. Village de valeur in French is um, savers. Fucking weird name. It sounds more strange for me. To me in French or anything else. Wait a second. I guess I think I saw something there. Uh, once again, I guess I'm tripping. What's that back there in the back of that garage? Anything? Or just a bunch of tires? Just a bunch of tires and a Blazer, or Jimmy, or S15, or whatever it is. You know. Yeah, the modern vehicles of today. The, these diesels, I should say, that sound like giant vacuums, don't they? Yeah. Pro shop, eh? Uh -huh. Right. Those old days, but good days, remind me of you. The memories we share. Da -da 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 -da. Look, there's a hummer. A hummer. Let's take a look down here, see if there's anything regard remotely interesting. A lot of fucking cars parked here, eh? No! At the uh, 9e rue. And a big fucking Remax sign. A Remax. I know. STL, good old non Nova scrap. Lord, that mother. Yeah. You know, actually, uh, last time I was around here, I think more north of uh, the street where I started the film, there was a garage there, and oh man, there was a uh, Lexus LS400, uh, but it was an SC coupe, and those are not very common. And man, I wanted to film it, but you know, I didn't feel like asking the guy, and I was tired. I didn't feel like asking the guy, can I film it? And it was also a, a customer's car, probably because. I don't know, plates are from Alabama or something. And then I saw another one days earlier, but it was on a private parking lot. It would have been way too obvious to film it and just... So, fuck that. No sorry, Bob. So what I'm going to do a little later, probably sooner than later, is jump on... Uh, I don't remember the fucking bus that comes. 904, 151, something like that. And it's going to take me right back to Côte Versu Metro. Or I should say Metro Côte Versu Metro Côte Versu. Or maybe I'll just keep fucking floating along and film this even into the into the bridge, eh? The La Chapelle Bridge there that takes you uh, 
Oh, there's that pickup I just saw. There you go, Andrew, that one's for you if you see that. Right on. 6.2 uh, diesel there. Diesel, diesel, fix a weasel. Or what a weasel. Yeah. Oh yeah, here comes that building. I think I filmed an elevator in here. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, this this building I think I filmed. There's a car wash here in the building. I think I filmed a really old revamped elevator. And, and it's just, it's the funny because the building doesn't look very old from the, the whole facade was redone actually. It's just, it's a, kind of like a fugazi. It's kind of a fake. But you get in there and you see that elevator. You see how small it is. You see the old Otis nameplate. And it's like, holy cow, that thing is ancient. You know? Oh, look at that. Ford Excursion. Shit, that's rare around here. Common in the States. Not here, man. Not at all. Wow. Isn't that something? Yeah, there's the joint. Yeah. Fuck, what is it about Ford diesels? They stink to high heaven. Oh, I see an old Benz there. Right there, old SL there from uh, the 80s. Man, these cars have a very high survival rate. I think even more than Cadillacs, actually, just because they were better cars. They were just better built. That's ugly. I fucking hate these. I never liked them. No. Bijouterie Edouard. <laughs> Which would probably translate to Ed's Jewelry. Let me just see something here. What was the bus here again? 151. Yeah, that's it. All right. Probably going to have to get some change, though. Let's just have a look, see if there's anything interesting parked down here. Beautiful lighting. Beautiful. Gold Econ line being used as a sign for gold. Buying gold, $55. Right. Right, how? Here's another uh, City Laval truck, I think, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Too bad the city doesn't have the best looking trucks, unfortunately. Yeah, I was here, uh, I don't know, three weeks ago? Something, uh, give or take? Two weeks? Three weeks? Three weeks. I filmed a cop holding somebody over. That was kind of exciting. Good old non-scrap there. Pasta mer. Mer, by the way, is French for ocean. So ocean is mer, M-E-R. Plaza 2000. Right on. Oh man, I'm fucking poop. Maybe if I'm lucky, I won't have to wait long for the bus. There's some old signs. Look at that. I like that. As old is but good is remind me of you. Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. But I don't like those he knows. It looks like a toy. I like manly looking vehicles. Fuck. No? Like a Mac DM, Mac S series, Ford L9000, Aeromax, C series, you name it. Those are all manly looking vehicles. What do you say, man? <sighs> yeah, beautiful day. Yeah, so yesterday uh, I went walking around Plaza. Uh, Plaza. Uh, it's Plaza. You're near the Point Claire Village there, off of there. I was at the. Uh, Lakeshore Road, and I wind up at St. John's, the beginning of St. John's, right at the bottom of Lakeshore. And uh, like I said, beautiful day, but fucking freezing. I started walking, I'm like, man, look at these houses. They're as old as some of the ones, a lot of the ones there on, on Lakeshore. And uh, I see this one house, and the guy's raking his leaves, and I look at it, I said, man. I said, how old is your house? He says, Nin I said, when was your house built? He says, 1910. I'm like, holy mackerel, 1910? Jesus, Murphy. And he says it was originally a church, and it, it looked like it was a church originally, you know? Frankly. 
Frankly, let's just go have a little peek here. See if there's any other cars. It'd be nice if I can get two oldies today, not just one. You can see the fucking simple clouds are coming back. Dag nabbit. Oh, where does this street go? I'm curious. I'm gonna have to come back here again, you know? Jeep Commander. Not a very successful vehicle, eh? Yeah. Speaking of not successful vehicles. Eh, eh, eh. Yeah, the old fucking uh, Chrysler Sebring, which was a success at first, but uh, it didn't last, you know? So. Oh, I see a good looking uh, Ford there. That sign that said that sign says priority for a turning at the uh, flashing light. What the fuck are you doing? What the fuck is this? What is fucking idiots doing? Oh my god! I don't know what the fuck is going on. Yeah, that guy gave me a look, man. I don't know, they got a bunch of fucking tires there. Oh, yeah, I guess they abandoned ship because they fucking ran out of gas. That's what I'm thinking. Fucking idiots, why don't you push your fucking car over if you run out of gas? Yeah, fucking morons. Fuck. Takes all kinds. Takes all kinds. Don't give me a look like that. Fuck. You're idiots. Push the fucking car. Jeez, you don't think I've never pushed a car before? I remember specifically riding with my friend Steve Gull. 1994, when I stayed an extra year in high school, I said, hey, let's go have lunch. Da, da, da. Okay, hop in his fucking newly acquired 1970 uh, Mercury Comet. Not a light car. <laughs> and the fucking thing runs out of gas. I had to push it down. Uh, oh, I don't know, two really long blocks or whatever. Man, oh man. Those fucking guys are morons. I've never seen that in my life. On a boulevard at rush hour or starting rush hour, you know? Oh my God. See? See why I like to film? You never know. You never know. Hey, I think that's that Hyundai I like. I always forget the name of it. What's it called again? Oh, now this guy's hiding the view. Yeah. Yeah. There's my cousin Grant's car right there, this Mazda 3. Yeah. Man, that Comet is there. That Mercury uh, drag car is still there. Shit, I forgot about that car. Last time they, there was a, last time there was an old car at this Midas dealership. I was by here a couple of years ago. I think it was a 62 Plymouth. And I asked the guy, like, can I make a video of it? He's like, ah, I don't think so. It's a customer's car. I guarantee you it'd be the same thing again. But I don't know. Maybe I should go ask. You never know. I mean, the fact that it's still there. Maybe it's the owner's car. But, you know? Oh, why not? I'm going to go take a look. Finish the video right here. I think I filmed long enough anyway. Hey, cool color. Wow. Yeah, that thing is like a total, like, uh, made into a drag car, you know? It's really neat. Cool stuff. Cool stuff, baby! Cool stuff. Also, anyway, I gotta check the schedule for the 151. I wanna get tired like this. I don't feel like fucking standing around. I don't feel like waiting forever. Look at this whole fucking motel, eh? The Shamari Inn. Woo! Yeah! Look at that design, eh? They don't design anything like that anymore. You gotta love that three-dimensional look. I don't know, whatever you want to call that. That kind of thing started, I think, in the 50s. You know? Smutstang. And the price of gas! What the fuck's going on, eh? Why? Is it because that American journalist got fucking uh, popped there by the uh, the Egyptians or the Arabs or whatever? Is that why the fucking price of gas is so low now? I don't understand. Or is it because I've been spreading the word? I even mentioned it about how fucking uh, the gas is now made here. You know, it's made here and it's made in the U.S. for Christ's sake. For the most part, we don't really rely that much on the Arabs anymore. Look at that! 117.4! Unreal! And look at the price of diesel. What the fuck is that all about? 137. 
What the fuck? It doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make sense. Anyway, guys, so that's it. Hope you liked it. And uh, I'm going to go see if I can film that Maverick or Comet, whatever it is. And is it funny, actually, that I brought up that my friend from high school is fucking Comet when I happen to forget about the one that's parked there? I don't know, eh? Anyway. So, uh, take it easy. Adios.